another one. Shout out po sa Hardware Next Philippines. Thank you so much po for sending me this hardware supply na magagamit ko sa aking mga projects. By the way, sa mga naghahanap po ng hardware supplier, Hardware Next Philippines is supplying hardware stores, construction companies, at iba pa since 1975. For dealership inquiries, check their links in my description below. To this video, we're going to reuse this old side table to make a storage cabinet. First, we need to remove all parts that we don't need. To put them together, I will use a wood glue and some screw to secure them in place. I decided to put the back panel later on. So installing drawer slides will be more easier. By the way, I am using a 16 inches soft close drawer slides that Hardware Next sent to me. It's time to measure the drawer's dimension and using table saw is the best to use when making drawers.
Time to install the face drawer. I will use black screw as a spacer between the flooring and drawers. After making the cabinet doors, I will now drill a 35mm hole for C1 concealed hinges. After I finish installing drawers and cabinet, it is time to put the back panel of the cabinet. I will apply epoxy primer white inside the cabinet and I will also apply lacquer paint white later on. I will prepare all the laminating sheet to be used in the cabinet and cut them in the desired sizes. By the way, I'm going to use Hardy Flex scoring knife. To cut the laminating sheet, I will use half moon file.
You can also use palm router with flash trim router bit. I hope you like the idea of reusing some old drawer. See you in my next video. Bye!